leader for 68 laps, overall winner in record time, the Henskin Pap Meekum Ferrari slips into the cool shade of the late afternoon at Road America's Victory Lane. Henskin and Paps covered the 500 miles in the record time of 5 hours, 42 minutes, 14 seconds, a record average speed of better than 87 miles per hour. Chris Economaki talks with the overjoyed winners. How about the driving the car, Walt, with the clutch pedal gone? Was it a real challenge? Well, yeah, I guess so. You might say that. It's, uh, it's, uh, you have to keep concentrating all the time. How about your hands? Did they suffer from that? No, no not a bit. No. You have to be just as easy without a clutch as you do with one. How about missing ships? Uh, did you have that problem crop up during the run? Uh, no. I didn't miss any, but the gears clashed a little bit now and then. Uh, Augie said earlier that it was rather noisy in the car. How about the cockpit temperature? Uh, the cockpit temperature wasn't too bad. Of course, today was rather cool, but uh, it was very good. Very comfortable car to drive. I guess, Augie, uh, having a winning co-driver makes you feel he's the best co-driver in the world. It sure does. The number 97 Cobra finished second overall. Ken Miles helping Skip Scott and John Morton bring happy times to the snake pit. Even happier than the overall winners, Joe Buzetta and Bill Wiestoff in the number 79, Robert Boach Elva Porsche. By virtue of his fourth overall, first under two liter win, Bill Wiestoff passes Charlie Hayes to finish second overall in the Drivers' Championship. In all, a championship afternoon at Road America 500.